You decide 2009 now. Toledoans have picked a new mayor. Voter cho voters rather chose independent Mike Bell over Democrat Keith Wolkowski. Take a look at those final numbers from last night. Bell getting 52% of the vote to Wolkowski's 48%. The difference was just more than roughly 3,000 votes. Just about an hour ago, the mayor-elect came here to the Fox Toledo studio, sat down with Laura Emerson, and the former fire chief talked about where things go from here. We are lucky enough to have the mayor-elect with us today, a man with a very busy schedule who's probably had very little sleep in the last few days. Have you gotten any rest, Mike Very Bell? little, very little. Okay, well, congratulations. It's okay, it's okay. All right. Um, you've been seen as a rescuer of morale, you know, when you took over the fire department. Do, do you feel like that's the role you're walking into now, the rescuer of morale in the city of Toledo? I think I, I'm just a provider of hope. And uh, the idea of working with so many people and, and letting them know that uh, I'm prepared to reach out and be a partner, I think it's a new concept in this area as compared to somebody that attempts to do it by themselves. And so that's why I say hope. How dramatic of a change are Toledoans going to see in the way government runs once you take over? What do you expect to be different? I expect us to be a lot more efficient. I expect us to be a lot more sensitive to the customer. I expect us to be a lot more respectful that we are public servants and that we work for the people who pay our salaries. So I, I think that it's, it's all an attitude. And then I think that also, though, when we look at how when we start developing these partnerships and, and doing team play, it, it's, it's a whole different uh, uh, way of thinking. When I went to the marshal's office, we had people that uh, acted independently as compared to as a team, and I had to change that mentality and when I did things started to roll really really well so I hope to be able to do that same to the inside of the city of Toledo and, and make it more efficient. So do you see an administration by committee as your style you know gathering information and suggestions from a variety of people? Well you know you can uh, you can use a democratic form of government or autocratic or laissez-faire. Mm -hmm. I think that my style uh, has a little bit of all those in there. It just depends on how much time we got to get certain issues accomplished on what style you have to be able to use. But uh, I like to get a sense before I make decisions of how people are seeing the impacts of those decisions so that it may be a blind spot that I'm not paying attention to that they're aware of. Mm -hmm. And if you got enough people paying attention to what you're doing that you trust, it makes uh, you'll make less mistakes when you make final decisions. How do you see your... Re your relationship with people on council. Are, will it be less adversarial than what we've seen recently, do you think? I would, I would hope that it would be just from the standpoint that if uh, I'm talking about reaching out and I'm talking about being, uh, making sure that we uh, treat council similar to a board of directors, and when you do that and people actually have a say in some of the decisions that are being made, I think there's a potential that it will be less adversarial just from the standpoint that we're talking about it before it, mm -hmm. you know, it gets out to the, to the public forum where it appears that we're on two different sides of the fence. At least if we're going to be on two different sides of the fence, that we'll know the reason why. And then the public can actually decide you know, who's right and who's wrong based on how it affects them. Okay, as long as you take your personal agenda out of issues, things become fairly simple in public government because you're doing it for the people. All right, thank you so much. Mayor-elect Mike Bell of the City of Toledo, congratulations and thanks for taking part of your busy day to be with us. No problem.